helicopter complaints. A man says the noise from helicopter tour choppers is unbearable. And 13 Action News reporter Yasmin Hassan right now is live near Boulder Highway and Russell. And Yasmin, you have a look at what this man is hearing. That's right. He says when he bought a house out here on the east side of town, he had every intention of living a nice, quiet life, but that is not what he is dealing with. So we wanted to get an idea of exactly how he's living. So we have Chopper 13 over us right now. I have to tell you, it's pretty much a constant buzzing. We've been out here for about 20, 30 minutes or so. It is causing a little bit of a headache, but this man says that he is living like this all day and pretty much all night. I call this the neighborhood under siege. Mark Hope says living near the wetlands has gone from a beautiful, peaceful area of town to a constant headache. He says from six in the morning until six at night, there are constantly helicopter tours flying directly over his home. The whole house vibrates. Some days are worse than others, but he says this is just not what he signed up for. If you buy a house near the airport, you're going to expect airport noise. But when you buy a house out here by the wetlands, you don't expect the and that kind of noise. We looked into it and unfortunately it's not as easy as just rerouting the tours. There's a specific path and a specific altitude that you have to fly. Our Chopper 13 pilot flew helicopter tours for years. He says the planning behind the route is a coordinated effort between multiple agencies. There's a letter of agreement between the FAA, ATC, um, and all the operators uh, where they determine, you know, this is the best path uh, for everybody. It also comes down to a matter of safety. Each helicopter has to be accounted for. All the pilots are sharing airspace and have to stay a safe distance away from all of the other aircrafts. If we could be good neighbors and cooperate with each other, it'd be nice. So, so it is a little more than just being a good neighbor, but that doesn't mean you're out of luck. If you're dealing with something that's similar to this, there is a noise complaint hotline that you can call and McCarran is uh, taking those phone calls 24 hours a day and we'll put all that information up on our website, KTNV.com. Reporting live, Yasmin Hassan, 13 Action News. All right, good.